is uh, coming out of that hiding a little bit and taking on some of the Republicans. She's gone after Jeb Bush, who you spend a lot of time with, a few times. She even made a, a, a comparison between terrorists and the way they treat women with the way Republicans did. What do you think she's up to there? I think she's trying to solidify the, the Democratic base and sort of remind them that she's willing to be that partisan warrior that they're seeking. Uh, it certainly rattled Republicans, and, and I think they're a little concerned that there was perhaps a little bit of a double standard this week about the way she was talking about them versus some of the things they've said about her in the past. But uh, I saw that sort of as a sign of, of desperation or at least an attempt to sort of tamper down the idea that, that, that others are surging or that they're going to get in. This idea that she's focused on on superdelegates, remember this from, from eight years ago, uh, it just sort of reminds me of a, of a student council race because the idea that a certain percentage of superdelegates are telling her, yeah, we're with you. Well, that's like you telling your classmate you're going to vote for him <laughs> when really you're going to go vote for the cute girl down the hall. I mean, it, it's just silly, it seems. At this, uh, yeah. Yeah. You are, Mark, you are everyone's cute girl yeah. down the hall. 